Perhaps you've seen this video on YouTube. It appears that this extremely loud car stereo is causing this girl's hair to levitate. But is that what's really going on? This video is, a, is an excellent example of what sound is because fundamentally sound uh, is the result of acoustic pressure fluctuations. And, and that would be air molecules moving forward and backwards, bumping into their neighbors. So sound is just vibrating air molecules, but if those air molecules bump into each other hard enough and fast enough, you not only get sound, you get wind, because that's essentially what wind is, air molecules in motion. And at low frequencies, um, you typically have to push a lot of air to, um, to, to put out uh, high volumes from these subwoofers. And those, those air molecules are fluctuating very rapidly forward and backward um, in and out of the car, and that, and that effect makes her hair appear to levitate. So the powerful sound waves coming from the subwoofers are pushing air molecules around enough to create not only low frequency sound, but wind as well. That in turn causes her hair to float on that wind contained inside the car. And there's a reason why she looks so uncomfortable. And that's because her stomach is probably vibrating as much as the air around her. She's probably quite nauseated because high output sustained low frequencies is, uh, is tough on the gut. For Discovery News, I'm James Williams, and that's Watch the Effect of a 24,000-Watt Sound System Explained.